couple months ago, I made a video talking about why R&B and rappers shouldn't be in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. That Hall of Fame is reserved for people who are rock artist or a metal artist band or whatever and the reason why i am making this video because one i have nothing else to talk about and two somebody told me about a couple weeks ago that jay-z of all people is being in the rock and roll hall of fame why is jay-z going in the rock and roll hall of fame it goes back to what i've said in my video about why rappers an R&B artist should not be anywhere near the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Why is Jay-Z in the Hall of Fame? Jay-Z can't sing. He can't play no instruments. Okay, can he play the guitar? Can he play the bass? Can he play the acoustic guitar? Can he uh, play the drums? Is he a vocalist? No, he's a rapper. He's an MC. Okay? He's a... Like, come on, what are you, the fuck are you talking about? Well, he made that song, 99 Problems, but a bitch ain't one. And it had little guitars in it. That doesn't mean that he should be in a Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Because what? So what he made that song and it had a little bit of guitar playing in it. Wow, it has some electric guitar in it. Whoa, he's a he's up there with Eddie Van Halen and, and, and you know, fucking Lemmy Kilmeister and shit. No, he don't belong in the goddamn Hall of Fame. As far as, like, Rock and Roll, put him in the Hip Hop Hall of Fame. There's a hip hop hall of fame, a rap hip hop hall of fame. Put him in there. You can't put Anthrax in a goddamn hip hop hall of fame. It would make as much sense as putting Beethoven in the jazz hall of fame. You know what I'm saying? Or Debussy in the country music hall of fame. What sense would that make? You can't do that. Or oh, let's put George Strait in the classical music hall of fame. What? Why? What are you doing? Oh my gosh, man. What is up with this whole. Let's put rappers in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. The, the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame is a joke. It's a fucking joke. There's so many people in bands that make great music, whether it's rock or metal, that are not even in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. And yet they, they put guys like Jay-Z, Tupac, Biggie, uh, you know, NWA. Why are they in the Hall of Fame of Rock and Roll? They're not rock artists, they're rappers. Biggie never played no instruments before in his life. I've never seen not one member of NWA play any instruments. They're not singers. They're not rock singers. They're not metal singers. They're not vocalists. They probably don't know jack shit about music theory, let alone being a vocalist or being a band player. They're not a, they're not a band. It's a hip-hop group, okay? Fucking Tupac never played no damn instruments. He's a rapper. That's all he is. The reason why I say metal is allowed to be in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame because metal did come from rock. All the difference between metal and rock is that metal is a lot more in your face, more dark and more edgy type of rock music. They rely more on guitar solos and playing with the guitar. And their drumming is a lot more, you know, sporadic and stuff like that. And as you know, the, the lyrics, that's what separates rock and metal for the lamest terms. Rock is a lot more nice, calm, smooth, sometimes it can be a little catchy and stuff like that. But it's like everybody has their place. The drummer is just as important as the guitar player and, you know, the, the vocalist or the vocalists, you know. Where in metal is like, you know, the guitar is like the main point of metal. But, you know, putting Eazy E in a guy named Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, what does he know about rock music? Well, he made that song Boys in the Hood and had a little rock flavor into it. Got a little rock. Flavor. He probably sampled that shit. They probably sampled it. Dre probably sampled it for Easy E to rap on. Just like how Jay Z probably has somebody to sample that uh, 99 Problem But a Bitch Ain't One song. Put it on that song so he can rap and he acts like, you know, he can probably tote around and say, I did her song with, you know, whatever. Didn't Jay Z made a song with Linkin Park or something like that? Again, Linkin Park, you could put them in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Not no fucking Jay-Z. I don't care if these rappers like Run DMC did a song with Aerosmith, okay? Aerosmith should be in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Put Run DMC in the Hip Hop Hall of Fame. Every each genre should have their own sect of Hall of Fame things, you know? You can't, it's like putting professional wrestlers in the Boxing Hall of Fame or boxers in the goddamn Professional Wrestling Hall of Fame. Like, what are you thinking? I don't care if they did a little bit of things with a rock artist or something like that. That don't make them rock artists. That don't make them metal acts. 
Oh, let's put Whitney Houston and Cher in the goddamn, I, I don't know, Classical Music Hall of Fame. Yeah, that'll make a lot of sense. Go, go fuck yourself. Why is the mainstream media trying to shove hip-hop down people's throats? Like, no. Not everybody is going to be a big fan of rap music, hip-hop, whatever. No, come on. Especially nowadays. Hip-hop sucks. It's garbage. It's 98% trash. The best rappers are going to be the ones in the underground or old school rappers. Those are your best rappers that you have. The old school ones and the real deep underground people. The people that you will find that may only have like 17,000 uh, followers or something like that. Or maybe a little under 100k followers on the internet per total. Those people who probably can barely hold down being a MC as their permanent job, as their career. That's where you will find the good rappers at, the good MCs. Not this bullshit that you hear it on the radio or as popular on the internet, okay? Those mostly, those people are fucking garbage. What's next? They're gonna put Lil Wayne in the goddamn Hall of Fame? I would, you know, I wouldn't even be surprised if they put Lil Wayne in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Yo, because Lil Wayne, he plays the, the guitar a little bit, yeah, and he's shit at it. Can't fucking play. Get the fuck out of here! Garbage. And a lot of people who actually play the guitar laugh at that dude. They say he sucks. Stick to. Yeah, <laughs> Stick to that, cause you can't play the guitar, dude. You're not a good, you're not a guitarist. You can't. You only plays one or two strings and play them together sometimes, and it sounds like shit, anyways. And he thinks that he's a. I don't know if he's still thinking that he's a he's a good rock artist or something like that. Remember that stupid ass album he came out with? Uh, what was it? Rebirth. I think that was his rock album. He came up with that stupid ass song, Prom Queen. It was the same dumb ass Lil Wayne nonsense. But it had a little bit of a guitar playing in it. And luckily, rock fans and metalheads looked at that album and said, this album is one of the worst rock albums ever. It's a disgrace. You'd be better off listening to Limp Bizkit than that bullshit. Come on. This would be that stupid as like snubbing MC Light, Queen Latifah, and Lauryn Hill for the likes of, you know, Slipknot and, uh, I don't know, Slipknot and Nickelback or something like that and put them in the Hip Hop Hall of Fame or in Linkin Park 2. Put them in the Hip Hop Hall of Fame but fuck MC Light and to hell with Lauryn Hill and Queen Latifah because you know they weren't legends in their own right. They didn't really showcase what a real female MC is supposed to really be like. No, let's put Linkin Park in the Hip Hop Hall of Fame because he did a rap song. They did a, did a song with Jay-Z and shit. Are you get out of here? Hip hop producers, beat makers, and all that—they can sample all sorts of guitar riffs from Iron Maiden and, and Eddie Van Halen all they want. But I'm sorry, you're not a rock producer. You're not a metal artist, or you know any of that. You're not anything like that. So stop putting rappers, hip hop artists, whatever, in R&B artists or pop artists or whatever in the fucking Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. They do not deserve to be in the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame. Put them in their own Hall of Fame. God damn it.